uh, the first one obviously is Try to Be Lost. I don't know if you have any story behind that one. Yeah. Oh, you want me to say now? Yeah, yeah. You go ahead and say oh. now, though. Play it. Um, I wrote that one in like 2015, probably. And I was working a shitty corporate job. And I told myself I was going to quit and work, actually go work for that artist. And uh, I realized that in that moment of being like, holy shit, I'm totally not knowing what I'm doing or getting into. It was just that, again, popping a bubble and just being like, fuck yeah, like being lost is the answer. Like that excitement that I felt and like getting into that and kind of embracing that um, perspective as like a youthful person, it just helped me to like move into that chapter and just move into myself, grow into myself in a way that was like exciting and embracing the space opposed to like, you know, freaking out and, and trying to just like build a space. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, let's, let's check it out. Track one. Track Try one. To lost. Try to be lost. <laughs> the intro and that really caught my attention when you like sent it to us i was like well, well i can definitely hear the grizzly bear kind of influences and in, like that type of song like this is very atmospheric into how you know how they do their music and sound and I, I i thought it was super dope hell yeah yeah thank you yeah my uh my i don't know that song took a really long time to figure out um because the demo is really cool and it was super raw when i recorded it and it was the first time i was able to like use my voice in a really confident way, I remember. And so trying to re-record it was really difficult for me. But the part about in the middle, this is kind of fun, but I talk about this guy named August Spies and he was the creator of Anarchy. And I found out I was living in his apartment, well, that he once lived in, in Chicago at the time when I wrote that song. And uh, he got hung. He was like killed by the police, like publicly for being an anarchist. And I thought he was just such an inspiring figure. And it like made me feel really like, I don't know, made me feel like affirmation. Cause I was like, fuck yeah. Like I'm on this path, I'm doing my thing. And like to feel connected to this person who was like on some shit before, you know, it was even in the public way of thinking. Like he was a fucking anarchist and I don't even know when it was like late 1800s maybe or early 1900s. And he was he was peaceful and stuff too um but it was just interesting and i remember just feeling like a sense of affirmation from the universe i was like august spies he doesn't tell lies and that's why he cries and uh yeah. wrote that little like nursery rhyme in there because i thought it was kind of funny and it was like paying homage to him and uh yeah i don't know just a fun fact that's like i love i like that song yeah thank you. very cool thank you very cool 